There are several saints who are named Elizabeth, the most famous being the kinswoman of the Blessed Virgin Mary and the mother of St. John the Baptist. But the Elizabeth whom the church honors today lived in Central Europe in the 1200s and was the daughter of the King of Hungary. Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and St. Elizabeth of Hungary was only four years old when she was betrothed to Louis, a duke who was only 11. Ten years passed, and they were married. And for the next six years, Elizabeth personally cared for the poor, the sick, and the suffering. In fact, at one point, her husband Louis became enraged when Elizabeth used their bed to care for a leper. They say he calmed down when he seemed to see in his mind's eye not the leper, but Jesus Christ crucified. Whether because of this vision or because he wanted the bed for themselves, he supported his wife in building a hospital for the poor. Tragically, after only six years of marriage and three children, Lewis died of the plague. Elizabeth was beside herself and said, Oh God, now the world is dead to me and all it contained of happiness. She became a lay or secular Franciscan and continued to care for the poor and sick, but only lived four years more. Her spiritual director wrote of her, Apart from those active good works, I declare before God that I have seldom seen a more contemplative woman. Her charity and prayer led many to declare her a saint, and she was officially canonized just four years after her death. Saint Elizabeth of Hungary, help us today to love God by loving our neighbor. Amen.